I know this matchup. I probably don't need these, but sure. <laughs> Alright, cool. Um, I'll take first, I guess. Okay. So this is interesting because if he can use his character ability to throw a cross, it covers everything except for... It covers everything that she could throw from the spell circle. Boost the spin size. She can steal my hand. Uh -huh. That said, this is clearly a different spectrum than I played because he just spent... Uh, Dread Reaper as Force, which is not a thing I do unless I'm playing the other dread, the other Judgment Rush. <laughs> well, not a thing I can do if I can at all help it. Alright, and he's adding his character building. Yep. Alright, I'm going to use this. Alright. Oof. That hurt. Interesting. Focus would have lost very hard to uh, Bloodthorns, so I'm a little surprised by that. Move first, anyways. Okay, never mind. Mm -hmm. I'm just, I got, I just confused myself there for a second. Okay. So yeah, I'll hit you for four, I guess. Gain advantage and draw a card. I'm gonna strike? Uh, no you're not. Oh wait, no I'm not. You gain advantage, that's right. Aha. Uh -huh. That was a joke. Thank you, D. All good. I'll strike here. Wilson? Uh, you should oh. only take him one damage. What? They only. Yeah, there you go. Okay. It's three power, so. <sighs> and it is Spectre Knight's advantage again. Yeah. <laughs> I'll strike here. <laughs> Alright, Wild Swing. I hope it's another one. Alright. Uh. Aha! I'm okay with this trade. Say my. I do have a card idea. But what's that last card? Ooh, I would not be okay with this. With my Actually, that, I, I like getting that card out of your hand. I really yeah. do. <laughs> Alright. Now bet. it's time. Right. Uh, there you go. Wait, no, I don't. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yes, okay. that was another advantage. Uh, okay. <laughs> Alright. Am I good now? Or were we, yeah, are you can, still. Yeah, you can, okay. You can now. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna strike. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Check your discard real quick. Okay. Um. Mm. Ah, man. Okay. Uh. Wait. Oh. That is a bull of Dread Talon. Calling out a focus or sweep. And we already know it focuses down, and so is the sweep, so yeah. Very bold. Don't want to do on my advantage. I got a lot of power, it's just... Oh wait. 
Strike. <laughs> Actually, literally does nothing. Yep. But, however, I can. It does something. Notably, that is not Black Death, so this is not optimal value as far as that goes. Um, yeah, this is your turn now. Going to do. Yeah, Spectre Knight did kind of dump a lot of economy, but he did get 4 gauge, so at the end of the day, probably still worth it. Uh, currently, and of course this is a season 4 character, so he's not especially like thoroughly developed in the competitive scene. Currently, I'm of the opinion Spectre Knight has to exceed. Uh, I was not expecting him to outright seal 16 cards. That's interesting. Wow. But, um, but yeah, currently I'm of the opinion that he suffers from having too weak an economy. He needs to exceed, um, and his exceed cost is probably too high, because he his exceed ability doesn't function without a gauge, so he basically has a 5 gauge flip, but he only spends 4 gauge, because he needs one afterwards for it to work, right? But yeah, I feel like his economy is a little bit too low. He actually has the seal your hand, draw, draw 4, strike, hit gain advantage, and that's good because um, you can use it to, to reload, but it only resets you to 4, right? He also has the 1-4 uh, special boost, draw 3, and strike, but, again, only re only gets you 3 cards. Like, you're spending essentially 2 cards, you're getting 3, although you're striking from your sealed area, not your hand, if I recall correctly. Um, it's not really helping you go up on cards, up on resources, right? So, he, he struggles for economy. That is essentially his problem. Uh, in my opinion right now. I think he has good cards, I think he has a great ability. I think he has excellent ultras. Um, but he doesn't have quite enough economy to maintain uh, momentum a lot of the time. So usually when I play Spectre, I play him... Uh, I remember recently I, tried, I described this to somebody really well, but I can't do it right now. Anyway, I, I basically set up a late game combo. Like, Oh, I know what I... well, never mind that, but I, I I curate a late game deck of here's my late game options that I'm going to reshuffle and go through after I exceed, so that I exceed, and then I have a deck that I can wild swing through with great reliability. That's what I like to do. Alright, Jeanette is flipping. Uh, she needs to discard a card, and then the game is on, because she now has all of her power budget, and he is very thin on remaining cards. I don't like the look of this for Spectre Knight. Guess why? I'm going to here. Five hmm. damage. Uh, okay. Much respect for this red talon. That worked. Uh, if you can win enough mix-ups that hard, then you'll be fine. But wow. Oh wait, did did he initiate with red talon and she defended with sweet? Okay, sorry. I thought I thought he defended. If he initiated, that's. Less bold, still very good. Like that, eating a sweeper or a charnel blast is kind of best case. But, yeah. We. Uh, yes, Reggie. So what I said was I I finally realized that the the way that I play Spectre Knight is essentially I play him like he's Arikune. Um. But uh, the way in which that is true is not completely apparent yet. <laughs> Uh-oh. So that's... Two, four... Seven? That is indeed seven. Cool. Sweet. So I do... Which stuns and knocks out that boost, which is massive. Uh, you know, massive is a different boost, but it's a big deal that it knocks out the boost. Mm. Oh, I'm gonna put you over here. Yeah, okay. Okay, I'm gonna do this, and then 
I will... yeah. I'll just prep here. Okay. And I will... Did you just chamber both copies of Cross? I'm a little bit surprised. Mine? Yes. All right. Uh, missed that one. Let's see. I will. I have not taken reshuffle, right? Uh. That's correct. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, I got confused of the last the last game. Yeah. Yeah. You did the deck and discard swap from your exceed, but you do not reshuffle unless I very much did something. No, you did not. Thank you. Welcome. I'll reshuffle now then. Okay. Then I'm going to place that, and then I'm going to spend no, a. Not. What, what? Look at your transforms. Oh wait, I don't have that yet. I don't have that. Nope. Never mind. I'm going to. <laughs> and then discard a card. Yep. This is all part of my plan. <laughs> and don't tell me it's not. <laughs> Side. Wait, what does this card do? Uh, <laughs> I cost three. Oh. Starting a card from the seal. <sighs> What's your damage here? Oh, wait, let me rethink that one, actually. Oh my goodness, I don't know. Okay, Spectre does have enough cards left to, to win this, thanks to those boosts. Uh, I personally am not used to using those boosts as much, but it looks like King Sunculus is. I lean a lot more on just striking out of a late game deck, basically. It's... Yeah. A lot. Um, but actually... Four. Alright, you hit first. <laughs> uh, you had two armor, so you should have only taken two damage. Oh, yeah, that's right. And then I have three, which I believe yep. all these are in range. Uh, so that is going to be 15 power. Yep. Alright, so I'm to one. Um, 15 minus 2 equals 13. Okay. okay, so in my turn, strike. Okay. Putting the blast internal blast. I know what I'll do here. Okay. So how much power is that? Uh, it's only two. It's only the two. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's just ignore guard. Yep. That makes me sad. <laughs> Did you wish to transform a card from hand or no? Uh, wait. Oh, I can actually do that from in here. Pardon me. Yeah, Carmen was a little greedy.
Whether I would scoop in this situation, well, I don't usually scoop anyway, but whether it's worth just surrendering here, to me, depends on what uh, Jeanette has up. Because he can strike with whatever he wants, essentially. For example, um, this death knell beats nothing. That actually kind of hurts a little bit. Uh, here, I'll hit you for first. Five. Mm-hmm. Is it five? Yeah, and plus two because I spent the game. Five. Yeah, he did it for his UA. So that's. Four. Oh, never mind. Sorry. Four. That's four. Okay. That is. That hurts. There was gonna be style. Okay, this is actually a really cool spectrum line. Uh, the like stealing, basically, half your deck. So that you can then use your boost to strike out of that, to have a ton of options at your disposal, and then lean on hand for resources and just spin one gauge every time. This is cool. This is not the way that I run Spectre, but I, uh, it looks legit to me. I still think that exceed is required, but now I think it's possible to take two different lines with it that are both successful. And there's probably more that I haven't discovered, but like I'm witnessing this one, and this is one that I run myself, so. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Are you spending a force to strike or? Uh, no, 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 no. I would just, uh. Alright, cool. I grabbed the two cards. Gotcha. Pay for barrier lantern? Uh, the cross from the edge. Got it. Okay. I'm gonna prep here. I don't understand that play at all. Just to get a block out of out of your sealed area. But like you threw away barrier lantern and you threw away a force from gauge to do it. All you did was bait a block. Like, I guess he was trying to bait some. Wait. Hang on. Was that Profane Sanctuary in there before the strike of the block? Yes. So yes. It's gone. Oh, yeah. No, thank you. Okay. I guess that could have been what he was trying to get rid of. Still, like, I would be way more aggressive here. But, you know, I tend to be more aggressive, so. Not more aggressive. I tend to be on the aggressive side of things and the overall balance of player, player aggression. <sighs> yeah, I really don't understand that specific from the grave play. Does it cost him Barrier Lantern from hand, Force from Gauge, replace the Gauge to pull a block out? All it did was defuse Profane, but like if Jeanette hits, she kills. The extra power doesn't really matter. Okay. Is your go? Yeah, I got him. Okay. Maybe 
he's hoping she'll initiate so that he can then use his ability like in response. Oh, okay, so I have to, you have to move past me, which is. I'll just assume it's very easy for you to do. It's not the most difficult thing. Um. Okay. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Strike. Yeah. Spectre Knight Dive plus ability would be really funny here, if he has it. Zane, remember to wait to reveal until he does, because he has a decision to make. Yes. Yeah, um... I'll go for a wild swing here, and I'll pay the gauge. Mm-hmm. Validation is very important. I got it. So, um, I guess I'll be far advanced the two, and then I didn't miss, and then retreat one. Oh, you miss? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna. Fortunately, that's. Where is it? There is. Okay. Technically, the attack is always last, but uh, Jeanette doesn't care, so you're fine. Yeah. Actually, I could do something magical. I'm going to put him in boost, and then I'm going to spend a force. Draw cards, Zane. Uh, oh, thank you. Damage incoming. Yep. Nice. Good game, though. Yeah. 